Man, just when you thought the limit was exceeded for fiancés possible to one man, we get some more. I'm telling you people, we got fiancés from England. We got fiancés from Australia, the USA, Canada. We got fiancés from all over the world. It is such a beautiful thing. I never thought, you know, I never knew that it was legal to have that many wives in the United States. But hey, I learned something every single day. We got Mr. Wade Wilson with another sad ass woman just thinking that she's all for him and he's all for her. It's crazy. But, you know, in proper fashion, he tries to get things out of these women. And I'm not even going to say too much more. Without further ado, let's go ahead and check this thing out. It is one of the funnier calls that we've heard in a while. Call one, England. Oh my God. I feel like phone calls from prison just has like a million calls. And now she's just like slowly just pulling out different countries, <laughs> like representation for the Olympics or some shit. Like, what the fuck is. <laughs> Call one, England. Like, what the fuck? Was this the Olympics? Or are they representing their countries? Who could be the most sexual female from, from their said country? Hello. 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 Why didn't you answer my call right before this? Oh, when I tried to answer, you just came up. When I tried to answer, it wasn't working. Hold on. The app. Yeah, my better. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Well, how are you doing, love? How's everything? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Except for except for my situation right now. That's why I have it. Uh, text that you were calling you yet because at know, least we know it's not all American girls that are crazy it's girls all around the world we got the Germans we got the English you know what I'm saying we got we got we got at least we know it's not just Americans you know I was feeling bad I was like maybe it's just us Americans are just fucking dumb but no it's a worldwide phenomenon like Listen, here's what's crazy, Andrew, you gotta understand, you only get the telephone one time a week, you get a shower once a week, I don't get any of, like, my food, like, my chips, cookies, all that shit, I don't, can't eat my shit, um, I can't use the phone, can't get visit, I can't mm, use the tablets, I can't email with the tablet, you get literally nothing in here, you're just, you're just with nothing, really f- mm. And so, like, luckily I was able to get the phone, obviously, because um, I wanted to, like, definitely call you and explain to you mm-hmm. so you know what's up. Yeah, so you don't think I'm mm-hmm. uh, ignoring you or, you know, something or such like that. Anyway. This is definitely something to keep mm-hmm. his mind going, for sure. There's no possible way you're calling th- this many people. And you know what I'm saying? This has to just be something to keep your mind occupied because ain't no way. Yeah, you, think that, no, okay. you know what I mean? That's mm-hmm. the last thing I'd want you to say. Yeah. Obviously. Is there anything that you can do like I don't know, like Is there anything that you can do like like you can talk to the to the police guard and, and, and ask them? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Isn't it like your bedtime over there? Like, go to sleep. What the fuck are you doing talking to Wade Wilson? It's like three in the fucking morning. Like, what the fuck is going on? You do realize that, right? Be- Bro. Well, listen to this. Here's one go to bed. Hold on. Hold on one second. Okay. Hey, here's, here's one thing that, that you could do if you, if okay. you want to. Um, yeah. You know, my lawyer from yesterday, the guy that did the closing argument, he's actually yeah. like a good guy. You know what I'm saying? My other lawyer sucks dick, right? But this guy's good. Yeah. And so I can give you his number. And if you want to call and just tell okay. him who you are. Um, and, okay. Tell me when you're ready. Yeah. Huh? Mm-hmm. You ready? I'm ready. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, perfect. Beautiful. Yeah. And his name is Kevin. Okay. And you just, um, you know, yeah. just explain. So the, the thing is, though, that is way wrong. Way wrong. That is not cool. Bullshit. Way so, you know, and, um, you know, I want to fucking use the phone. I want to fucking, like, call you. I want to fucking visit with you because, like, I fucking had just turned in that visit list, you know, so, like, I was hoping to see you, like, 
all of that yeah. I want to do, you know. So, um, yeah, you could try to call okay. him. Okay. I'll call him. He seems to have a lot of faith in Kevin, bro. He always talks about Kevin like he's such a good lawyer. Listen, Kevin's no better than the other lawyer who took your money and went away. Kevin was just more convincing, apparently. The fuck? They can't do anything to save you. They're, they're spending money on these lawyers to just file paperwork and disappear. You know, give me, you know, uh, put me on retainer and I'll file something. And then after that, they just disappear, bro. They're not doing nothing. What can they do? Idiot. Kevin probably, Kevin is probably just the one with the least amount of clients. Let's just keep it real. That's why Kevin can respond. Definitely. Absolutely. And if you, if you feel like that's not good enough, you may like tomorrow, um, and want to call to like the jail and like make some sort yeah. of like uproar about it i wouldn't say now because it's like nearly 5 p.m here but you would want to do that yeah. at like 10 a.m here so whatever time it would be there compared to 10 a.m here mm -hmm. about you two, would... six, and, um, five hours so yeah about three o'clock my time in the afternoon or in the morning I'm yeah you'll be in the, yeah, in the afternoon right 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 okay yeah. so that would work out then that would be good yeah definitely that would Okay, so if you can try to do that to tomorrow, I think you should. If you can remember to do that, I mean, that would really yeah, be... Yeah, For sure, for sure. Okay. Well, mm. but, um, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. No, it's not okay. Uh, no, it's not. It sucks. It's not okay. Mm. It's, it's, it is what it is right now. How are you? How you been, girl? I'm fine. I miss you. And now I'm worried about you even more. Well, help me. <laughs> help me. Well, help me. Oh, my God. What a bitch, bro. Holy shit. Wait, is such a... He, he begged... Like, imagine... I said this before. Your whole career of just life is begging women for help. Isn't that just shame? It, it, that's shameful. Well, help me. <laughs> Please. Ah, I need help. Please. Imagine your whole... Just everything about you is... You, you lived at a woman's house. You drove a woman's car. She, she had to take care. Now, now you're in jail. Now a woman's taking care of you. Like It's like everybody's your fucking mommy, bro. I'm sorry, but that shit is just... As a man, you should be ashamed. You should be fucking ashamed of yourself. What the fuck? <laughs> well, help me. Ah, please. Oh, my God. Help me. You're such a bitch, bro. Holy shit. Put some panties on when you go in prison because that's what you need. You don't need underwear. You need the panties. I'm going to do. <laughs> yeah. That. So, it's kind of a okay. weird situation. That's Help it. me, please. Okay. That's insane. Hold on. Let me back this shit up. Yo, what's up, Dreadhead? Okay. Oh. Well, help me. <laughs> help me. Okay, I'm gonna help me. Whoa. That's so sad. What about you? Even more. Well, help me. <laughs> help me. Think I'm gonna do. <laughs> yeah. That. So, it's kind of in a okay. weird situation. A bit. Okay. Okay. Hopefully, your lawyer will do something now. Oh, yeah. I hope you I also, too, baby. I also, too. I also, too. Well, well you know, when I can't get is the that, phone is or that nothing, so... it's wild. Is that when you go to court? Is it July? Well, I, oh, no, that's mm. in July 23rd, yeah. But, right, yeah. yeah, but you see, the thing, though, too, is, is, like, that'll be where we go back for the judge again one more time for this case, and he'll just finish off but, um, the situation. But um, what was I going to say is, no, nah, I still have, like, a drug trafficking case. But, you know, I was just going to sign off on that and just and get it, get out of here, you know what I mean? Like, just sign it. Yeah. Get out of here. I got like drug trafficking and I, I have an escape charge too. Oh, uh, make sure you tell her about the stabbings. You have like a bunch of stabbings in jail too. Make sure you tell her about the stabbings. We don't know which side, but there were stabbings on your record, right? You got drug trafficking. I'm, 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 I'm a scary guy. You know, I was a part of a gang, you know. Not to mention your teeth got knocked the fuck out for impersonating the gang, but uh, tell her that part too. Tell her all that good shit. So, but, you know, mm -hmm. those don't even fucking matter, right? They're not, they don't fucking carry shit compared to whatever else is already so i was gonna just sign him and get the fuck out of here um but um power to shit yeah and that's when you gotta like yeah. and get the lawyer involved and shit because then you know you need to back up type shit. 
you think type you shit. Help? Yes, I think that guy right there will. My other lawyer, the one that lost the trial for me, no, but the guy, they just gave you the number. He's the one that tried yesterday at the end of the trial, and I thought he did a good job anyway, so he's a good, he's, 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 he's worth the fuck at least a little bit. That's the number I gave he's you. The one... Yeah. He the one... gave the closing argument last night. Yeah, the you know other I mean? one on it, he kept looking like he was falling asleep during it. There was one, at one point, he was said, sat next Everybody to you. said that, don't they? Yeah, he was like... He was like, when I was watching it, he just kept like, when I was watching it, he kept closing his eyes like he was falling asleep. And I was like, oh, he's doing a good job. <laughs> Maybe. He's falling asleep because he's fucking old and he fucking doesn't care. He needs to fucking retire from being a fucking lawyer. Seriously. Mm -hmm. That guy does. Maybe it's because he knew they were losing. Like, what can you do, right? It's like a guy murdered two women and admitted to it. What can you really do but take a nap? Shit, I would be right there taking a nap myself. The fucker would, like, what am I supposed to do? I gave the statements. Now, prosecution is going to spend the next 45 minutes tearing you a new asshole. What am I supposed to do but take a nap? I'm trying to regain my strength for when I need to go up next. The fuck? You're, you're cooked, bro. You admitted twice, three times, four times. Like, what are you, <laughs> you're cooked. Let me get this nap so I could give a proper ending statement. Shit. Don't blame him because you fucked yourself. That guy does. <laughs> hey, but you you want to know if, um, you know, you know, want to know what's been on my mind, though? What? Are you going to act like you don't know? Wait, well, I, I don't know. The pictures? No, the kitchen. What the uh -huh. hell are you talking about? No, what's been on my mind? Even through yesterday and everything and right now and everything. What's been on my mind? Do you know? I don't know. I'm gonna, mm. I should probably just tell you. You. Oh, You've wow. Been uh, You've been on my fucking yeah. mind. You've been on my... You said yeah. that kitchen. What, you took this like I'm hungry? Yeah, I, I am fucking pictures. hungry, but... Oh, the, pictures. Oh, the, I thought you said the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, I am a little hungry right now. Uh, <laughs> kid. Yeah, those pictures, too. Yeah, those pictures, too, though. For sure. Glad you brought that back up. Aww. Glad you brought that back up. <laughs> You just wanted to re-remind me of what's mine, did you? You want to bring that back up? Oh, that's mine? What's mine? What is it? This really shows that there's just idiots across the world that you could just manipulate, do whatever the fuck you want with them. Because there's no way in hell that this girl doesn't know that he's talking to other women. But she's cool with it. Just just if she gets some, if she gets herself some attention, that's good enough for her. There's some other girls like Vivian who has a whole fucking mental breakdown when you talk to other girls. But this one, you could tell she's just playing her part. She gets her attention. Nothing at all is ever going to come of this, but she feels a little good inside. That's what a lot of these phone calls really are. It's just a bunch of girls that feel like shit. They feel nobody cares about them. People spit on them. People treat them like shit. And Wade makes them feel nice inside. The sexy tattooed man that makes me feel nice. You know, that's all it really is. It's never going to happen. Angel. It's never going to happen, but it makes them feel nice and cozy inside. That's what this is like therapy for crazy people. Okay, Including what? Oh, okay. What's down there between okay, those? Okay. I'll just say um, it. that's mine, isn't it? Mine. That is. Yeah. What's yes. her? What's her? Yeah. I bet she's gonna start jerking off into the fucking phone like you did with the last girl. I have been thinking about, I have been thinking about those pictures. I'm glad you said that, though. I really have. I really, really have. Yeah. They were great. That was so great. Hopefully. Now, you know, huh? Huh? I said, hopefully, I can send you more of them. I can send you more of them. Of course you can send them more of them, because you don't have nothing to do. You probably don't have a job. You probably have two kids. And you probably have somebody who takes care of you. This shit is so, it's predictable nowadays. Hold on. You know, every person, you know. We know what you come with. Nobody wants you. You probably have a kid. And you have low self-esteem. That's the big three. <coughs> What's up, Stars Align? Is that, how will you know if I contact, like, because you can't get my messages, can you? So, like... No, I cannot, cannot you... but I will. What I'm going to do, though, is tomorrow, like, I'll be able to get the phone. This phone right here. Okay. Th this phone right here, it's, like, on wheels. And they push it over here to the door, you know. Um, I can probably get it tomorrow, so like I'll be able to, 
I'll be able to call you like afterwards and see what's up. Okay. With things. You know what I mean? Like outside, like call you like around lunch, which is like after 10 o'clock here. So after you would, you know, maybe do your thing or you call the lawyer yeah. and stuff. Yeah, for sure. And you could just. Can I call, can I call the lawyer today? Like after right now. Call? Of course. Yeah, will you be free? Do you think? Absolutely. Yeah. I think it could be the good, uh, about an ideal time. It would be a pretty opportune time to call you. A pretty opportune time. Good. Shut the good. fuck up. And the it, wor- wor- worst is you, you just need the message, your number and your name and whatnot. And, you know. This would be a pretty opportune time. Bro, you accidentally put that in the correct context. That was just a mistake. You know, they say a dog has, get, gets, has his day every once in a while. You, this shit, you accidentally put that in the correct context. But hopefully he picks up. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'll send him a text, too, if he doesn't answer. I'll be like, okay. this is so urgent. <laughs> <laughs> is that what you say? Oh, you're going to say That's that? Say. Yeah, I like A-S-A-T. My man, I got to get my man out of there. I'm going to get my man some help. Okay. Yeah, I got to get my I gotta get my husband out of there. He's trapped right now. Uh, what? Yeah. Oh, is that not true, though? Is that true? No, that is. Oh, her no, to that him. Is. Okay. Yeah, oh, because he's going to marry her. Oh, because he's going to marry her, of course. Yeah, I forgot that last little detail. He's going to marry her. I forgot how to do it. I was on Google. How to do... Wait, how, how to do what? How to, to get married. Oh, to tell me. Out. Why are you take? Why you, you just took the whole to. call before you told me? I can't even believe you. That should have been the first thing. You have one minute remaining. And then he just goes to the new girl. Contact the prison warden and yeah. write a letter, and I have to contact the prison warden Lord. and write a letter, and then okay. they make a decision. Oh, don't let us! No, don't let us! Listen, listen. So in about mm-hmm. maybe two months, I'll be over there. Yeah. And that's when we're over gonna here. Do it. And that's when we're gonna do it. What in England? No. Well, oh, you're saying while you're there, oh. could, could we? Oh, Are you ask- no, sorry. I thought you meant you was coming to England. I was like, how are you doing that? No, <laughs> no, no I wish. they're not going to send their most degrade, most degrading, disgusting. We're not, we're not going to send the worst part of our population to a foreign country. We're going to keep them right here. Thank you very much. We're going to fry them in the chair right here in our own country. Thank you. The fuck? Go to England. Hey, what if there was a thing where? Hey, what if there was a thing where we got we got married? And they could they could transfer me there. <laughs> what a fucking sad fucking moron. What if we got married and, and, and they transferred me to England? At this point, we're, we're talking about make-believe. Start making books so that the kids could read the make-believe that you created. You know, once upon a time, a man killed two women, went to prison, and was able to go to a far distant land to find the love of his life. Like, make some make-believe stories. It might go a long way in the future. Other than that, you need... Bruh. Bruh. But again, you know, it's something to think about. It's something to keep your mind occupied. That's the main thing. That's what I think it is. It's something to keep your mind occupied. That's good. <laughs> like, what if I got to get over to England and, and have conjugal visits with you four times a week? What if I was able to do that? You know? <laughs> keep that mind active, buddy. I'd love you tomorrow. That would be dope. That would be dope. <laughs> Hey, I love you. I love you, I love baby. you. I, I love you, too. Okay. I promise yeah. you, I will. Thank you for using GTL. Yeah, bitch, see? And he's never going to talk to you again. Oh, my God. Oh, isn't that such a shocker? Now he's talking to the Canadian girl. Guess what? They're about to get married, too. What is... Hello? Hello? Hey. Sounds How like are Ari. You? <laughs> I'm good. How are you? I'm good. She sounds a little, a little aggressive. I don't know. She kind of scares me a little bit. I'm gonna talk to you. How's it going? I'm good. How are you? Man, I'm good. I'm hanging in. I'm straight. <laughs> she sounds like she'd throw my legs up. Sounds like that's the type of girl we we're dealing with. Hold on now. Hell yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Like honestly, honestly, like right now. What's not good is, like, I don't have, like, my tablets, so, like, 
I don't know if you've messaged me or something like that, but if you have, I don't have them. So it's like, that's, I can't see shit on my tablet. They got me, when I came back from court yesterday, they put me in this thing, like a suicide area, just like, as like protocol, after like a situation like that. Yeah, exactly. Uh Right, but they were supposed to let me out this morning, clear me from here, but the lady that came to see me, she brought some guy, and I like kind of got into it a little bit with the guy, like really, but I still like answered the questions. But then instead of like clearing me, she's like, oh, well, he's not suicidal, but he's impulsive. Cause she was like mad that I got into it with like her colleague a little bit, and so therefore mm-hmm. she like kept me in this bitch, and she made a comment today about like keeping me in here till like I go to prison. But everyone's like, yo, we're not gonna let that happen. Like the people working here, so I don't know. So I'm just gonna have to see what's up tomorrow. So right now I'm like negative in a little fucking outfit thing, and I'm like, <laughs> I don't have my tablets. I can't check my emails. I don't know what the fuck's going on. But whatever. How are you so calm? Because I'm always calm. You've seen the trial. I'm because calm. he's fucked. What else I'm is he going to be? You don't say a word. Right. And I'm calm. <laughs> Real calm. You know why? Why? Uh, you have to think about it. Think about it. I'm just calm. Because... Do you ever just like think that like you're there forever? Oh, well, yeah, I'm definitely thinking that now. <laughs> that's for sure. <laughs> man, that's for sure. Yeah, don't start all that shit with me, though, talking about for. Yeah, man, I know. Didn't remember I sent you that fucking message on time. Like, okay, cool, but when you find something, girl, you better figure out what you want to do with it, even if you find it at whatever point. And I'm just saying, even if I'm going to, like, death row or whatever, like, bro, for a little bit, you know, it's like so you see, that's lawyers, that cope right lawyers, there. Like, that's that cope. Remember? Remember, he has to ease himself in there. He can't just be like, yeah, I'm going to death row and I'm dying. We can't do that. We have to cope our way into it. So, you know, you know, even if I go to death row for a little bit, like, I mean, what's 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 a few years, 10 years, 15, 20 years and then dying on death row? You know what I'm saying? Like, what's what, what what's going to death row for a little while? You know, I'm just going to be there for a little bit. Maybe 25 years until I die, you know, maybe not. But what if I go to death row for a few years? You know what I'm saying? He, he's, he's, he's amping himself up because he knows that's where he's going. But you have to cope your way into it. You have to trick your mind. Like, yeah, just for a few years. I'll figure it out. Dumbass. Fight my case and shit. But while I'm over there, um, I already found out, like, they, get, they changed some laws a couple of years ago. Like, people on death row, they get contact visits. They get all that shit, like... It's not like, oh, somebody comes to see you and it's behind a fucking, like, glass window or some shit. No. You get fucking visits, like, for real. Like, real visits and shit. So, like, in the meantime of me being there, I'm not stressing that. I just want my visits. I just want visits. That's fair. I'm cool with a visit. You're, like, uh, if you're in Canada, you would yeah. be out in 12 years. 12. You said that. There ain't no, That's wild. There ain't no death penalty. There ain't no death penalty here. And, like, really? our system sucks. Yeah. Like, if you kill somebody, you're out in less 12? than 12 years. What? Really? 12. Yo, that's wild. Yeah. Hey, listen, you know what it's all about? I, I shockingly, I, I, mm, I, I, for some reason, I don't believe her. Both first degree and second degree mer- murder carry a mandatory life sentence. Bitch, what the fuck are you talking about? Are you living? What, what? Bro. What the fuck? Yeah, in Canada, you could just kill people and get out in 11 years. Both first degree and second degree murder carry a mandatory life sentence. The difference in charges deals with parole eligibility. If you are convicted of second degree murder, parole is granted between 10. Oh, that's probably what she means. Is granted between 10 and 25 years. But you have to be a really perfect criminal to get out in 10 years. Parole is the judge's discretion no you 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 do a long time just like the u.s you said i'm canadian it's true someone else said i'm canadian life here is 25 to 50 years well i mean i'm reading it right here so you might get out in 10 years but a person like wade wilson you're not getting out in 10 years you know what i'm saying wade wilson getting parole come on now about over here what it's all about over what? here is that money, that motherfucking money. These mother, 
Yeah, th- that's all they're about is that money. Cause every every person that gets locked up over here, man, it, it has a value to that person. Um, What's so up, like, Vanessa? Check this out. If you ever Google this, you can Google look up um bid bonds, B I D, and then bonds, B O N D S. Check that shit out. That shit'll blow your mind. Some real shit. You can check what it is out. That? Bid bonds. It's just about how like people that get incarcerated, they're worth a certain value and they get traded and stuff like. Um, there's even stocks for it. Like, there's there's stock there's stock there's actual physical like stocks for it. Yeah, yeah, it gets real crazy. Look up bid bonds. Check that shit out. It'll blow your mind. Bid bonds. Yeah, yeah. Not right now, but when you get it later. Yeah, this is wild, girl. It's wild. wild. But like girl. I said though, when I go to the the next place I'm going to, man, I'm cool, man. I just want my visits. Why my lawyer? Why I get some new lawyers who working on my shit? I'm just I just want my visits. Cause I got you. Yeah, you I actually got, need to get rid of that old man. Cause like he's he, trash. He's so he trash. sucks so bad. Like, Garbage. R- the whole world said that, <laughs> right? For real, man. Like the whole world said that. He's so, he's he's straight ass. Like, like, he sold me out. He sold me out. Straight sold me out. Like straight <laughs> sold me out, bro. Yes. So, but it's okay. Yeah. So, so can you appeal or what? It's like you only get one chance at a feel? No, 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 no. No, you get more than that. No, you get multiple, 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 multiple. I'm not quite sure right now how many for sure, like, factually, but you get multiple. And then you, like, like, dude, I already have, like, like I got plenty of reason to come back on ineffective assistance of counsel, obviously. Just, it, like, you know, like what you just said, right? So that's all day. That's all day. A good lawyer is going to file under that. So my next lawyer will do okay. that. Yeah, I'm straight. I just need my visit though. I mean, I, I mean, how much can you do, right? How much can your lawyer really do when you tell the police? Like, I don't even know why they had a trial. He admitted to it. I thought when you admit, there's no trial. But I guess he took his statement back or whatever and said he was innocent. But he showed the police where the girl was. And he wanted a Big Mac to do it. And he said, yeah, it's going to take you really long. You're not going to find her. I really hit that bitch, so you're not really going to find her like that. It took, you know what I'm saying? Like, with conviction, just give me a Big Mac and I will show you. So, like, what are you talking about? He sold you out, stupid. He can't do nothing. All he could do is show face. He's there. He showed up. That's it. That's all he could really do. You're fucked. Regardless. People one person I need to come see me, so yeah. As long as I can get my visit, I'm straight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I got somebody I need to come see me and shit. So yeah. This person that this person that's yeah, just this one this one girl I know. I kinda know a little bit. Just this one this I one I can't chick. be the only one messaging you. Nah, there's like tons trying to. If I go look at my friend request I probably have like almost like a thousand. It's crazy. It's a lot. I yeah, I would I would imagine. Yeah, would but imagine that doesn't mean I'm, I don't have time to talk to people like that. I have to choose who I want to <laughs> talk to. I don't like talking to too many people. No, nah, that's for real. Cause mm. I don't. I don't like talking to too many people, bro. This is a whole new set of women. Remember, maybe like a week and a half ago, we were listening to calls. He was talking to a whole fleet of women, and it wasn't these ones. That means it's like five, ten, fifteen. You don't like talking to a lot of people, though. What a fucking psychopath. He don't like talking to a lot of people, though. Bro, you talk to more people in the, than the entire jail. I promise you. Again, GTL is making a killing off of Wade Wilson. They know his name personally over there at GTL because he pays most of the bills over at GTL. Wade Wilson, single-handedly. He's paying the bills. The fuck you, t- <laughs> the fuck you mean? You don't like talking to that many people. The fuck you? He'll answer anyone's call. That's like his job in there. It's like a full-time job. Like people like that. I have to like really, I just like choose and then find out who I want to talk to and then that's it. I don't really like people like that. You but, love people, bro. But I don't know. There's one girl, I've seen her pictures too and she's, she's something special. She's real, <laughs> real nice. So. <laughs> they, uh, rejected my butt sister. <laughs> but then I sent I sent another one more? and they accepted it. Woo! Oh, I haven't seen it yet. Damn it. 
Yeah, they accepted when it. I, but the one, I'm like, I had my underwear on, and they rejected it, but then oh, I had shorts on. Bro, I, I'm sorry. It, so you know what it's about. This chick sounds rough as fuck around the edges. I think she owns a Harley. If I'm not mistaken, this Canadian chick rides a Harley. Just saying. It's just about the person. The person, like, doing it. You know what I'm saying? They're picky. And then sometimes the person doing it might be like, man, this dude weighs, this dude weighs, like, too much. Like, okay, I'm going to design his pictures. Like, this dude. And they just, like, hate on me. Fucking hate. So, yeah. So, if they ever do that, just resend that shit. Or send another one. So, I got to get it. So, you, what you're telling me is I got to hurry up and get off this suicide and watch shit, huh? There's no well, shit, Wade. Well, you go over yes, there and see this booty picture. I sent you, like, four messages yesterday. I'm like, what the f And then <laughs> you called. But it told me I had to put money on. So, I was like, what the f and what, on the phone and shit? It? Oh, you said you put it on yeah, the phone? Yeah, because uh, like Canada. And then you're like, so, why is he not fucking wanted, calling? Well, exactly. Told, and then they want sure. like a, your guys' postal code, but here in Canada, it's six letters. Yeah. So, but then it finally worked. Right, 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 right. For sure, yeah, 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 yeah. For sure. Well, listen, also, like, also, like, I need to get, maybe they'll let me off the suicide watch tomorrow and we're going to see what happens. Because, like, also, like, when I get back over to my room and shit, right, like, for sure, I need to, like, you know, call you because there's, like, something we got to do. So, like, you know what I'm saying? So, um, what? just give me a minute because I need to get out of here so I'm not, like, being watched. Mm -hmm. But when I get back to my room, I got something I'm going to do to you. So I hope you're ready. Mm -hmm. He's yeah. probably going to ass assault her earways. He's probably going to tell her the most foul shit. It's probably a Patreon call is what he's about to do to her. I got something to do to you. I got something to tell. We already know how Wade gets down. I think the whole population knows how Wade gets down. He even said to the... That wasn't even on Patreon. He said to the police officer, he prefers the asshole. He wants that asshole. He, if, if it was up to him, he wouldn't even fuck your vagina. <laughs> he wouldn't even go for the vagina. He wants straight booty meat. Asshole. Anal canal. That's what, that's what Wade is into. That's what he's about to tell her. I am you know ready. what I'm talking about, don't you? You're ready. <laughs> yeah, I know. You know exactly what I'm talking about, don't you? You're ready. Huh? I don't know what yeah. you're talking about, bro, I'm but I have an idea. I'm going to make that little thing mine. That little small, little <laughs> tight, little good thing you got. That me. small, little tight, little, is that, her, is that between her legs or behind her legs? Which one? Her small, little tight, little kind of sounds like something that's behind like it's not between it's kind of behind the one that's portioned to kind of expel waste from the body uh, yeah i don't know what the pretty little tight little he's talking about is but i'm i'm intrigued that's all i can say i'm i'm intrigued make it mine yeah hopefully you have no more. idea <sighs> i hope you i hope i figure that out though what's up Ms. I wanna, um, pandora i want to i want to have a real good idea so hopefully we change that tomorrow. Oh Lord, we'll have to. Yeah. When do you go, go to prison? <laughs> <laughs> Man, it's not gonna be long. I have to go back to court on the twenty third of next month, and then after that, it'd be like two weeks after that. So we're looking Sounds at like a uh, roast, but August, August, <laughs> August. Let's just say like August, beginning of August. Get the fuck out of here. Be on my way over there. And I'll get over there. I'll get a phone. I get a cell phone. I'll be able to get visits and shit. And you're fucking getting your ass over here to come visit me, girl. So you you better I go ahead and get visit. ready. I know you will. You know, yeah, I know you will. And you better go ahead and start looking at tickets and shit for August. Go ahead and get your shit right. Oh, they're cheap. Huh? <laughs> they are cheap. I've been like I've been. Since oh really? Like, yeah, like yeah. like what? What for a one way? Or okay, both uh, ways? What, what is well, it? Well, I didn't look at Florida, but. I yeah. went to Nashville, and it was 400 round trip. Oh, that's right. Oh, that's good. That's cheap. Oh, okay. Cheap. Yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. Why did you go to Nashville? What you were doing over there, girl? What you were doing over there? Um, just partying. Just partying? And I met, yeah, I met Reba McIntyre at the Grand Ole Opry, actually. <laughs> really? That's dope. Yeah. That's cool. That's what's up. Yeah, nice. That's great. Nashville's the shit. I got some people that live there, so I've been there a bunch. It's fun. A lot of fun. A lot of fun. A lot of fun. Yeah. So, but yeah, so that's what's up. We'll definitely do that, and um, we'll make that happen. 
we'll make it happen. So. How often do you get visits? Every single <laughs> weekend. <laughs> every single so weekend. So how? Friday. Our how way, do wait. people have sex? All right. So look, here's how it happens. You ready? So look. Yes. Let me tell you this first. Every time, like. Where? Here's how it happens. You're ready, bro. You're on a recorded line. You're talking about how people have sex. You don't think that they're listening to this call like, what's this fucking jackass? Bro, you're not sticking your dick through any bar holes. She's not putting her... She, You know what I mean? It's not going to be... It's, not, it's none of that happening. You are on death row. Your penis is not going anywhere close to a vagina. You, Bro, the reason you're on death row is that you can't... I feel like, personally, is so that you can't continue the crazy genes, bro. You think the last thing they're going to let him do is get on somebody. Are you insane? Please, but let's hear how it happens on this recorded line as he gets really quiet to let her know what's happening, how how we can have sex on the, how we can have sex on the visits. But we're doing it on the recorded line, you fucking idiot. Like what? All right, wait, wait. How do people have sex? All right, so look, here's how it happens. Hey, hey, here, here's how it happens. So, everybody, do you hear me? Testing, testing. Okay, so this is how we're going to do it. So look, let me tell you this first. Every time, like, let's say where I go, right? See, here's how it's going to go. The officers where I go, right? I'm going to get them on the team, on my team, on my side, right? Oh, you're going to get them on the team. Okay. Okay, so they could get fired because this is recorded. So everybody who got on the team, they can, oh, okay. Yes. Okay. All right. Continue. I'm sure the warden is over here fucking pissing himself listening to this call. Let's continue, though. Yeah, a lot of those officers, they're going to fuck with me, like, real hard, right? Yeah, they're yeah, gonna yeah, be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. This, this dude's got it going on. They're gonna fuck he's got it go. He's He's got it going on. This mm. dude has got it going on. That's how crazy they're going to fuck with him. They're going to say, yo, this inmate that's going on death row who's going to die for killing two women for no fucking reason... He's got it going on. This guy, he's he's just, we're going to fuck with him. Let's continue. Now, when that starts to happen and shit, now I'm going to have him, like, doing things for me. You know, yeah. I might, be, I might be shooting a guy, like, you know, a couple thousand dollars, yep. have him bringing me in phones or yep. whatever, right? And so he's bringing shit. Naturally. So long story short, he's not going to get no pussy. And if she believes this story, she's a fucking moron, which I believe she's going to listen to it for me blah 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 like shit like that right now that i have like my little people like situated so mm-hmm. let's say you come to visit me right so i just tell i just tell the guy right or another guy or whatever guy right yeah. i'm like look man yeah. me and my girl i'm about to go right over here and i'm about to f- the shit out of her so just i just, yes. just stand over there and just you know what i'm saying keep it cool right and he's gonna be so fucking cool that he's gonna keep a lookout the prison guard is gonna keep lookout so that you can just fuck the shit out of your girl. Oh, my God. The guy who doesn't even have a girlfriend. The guy who gets paid minimum wage to, 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 look, at, to look after animals such as yourself. He's just going to keep a lookout. I got you, bro. I gain nothing from this. I only stand to lose from this. But I got you. Fucking asshole. He's already on my team, yeah. so he's already down with the play. And he's going to let me go over there. And he's going to let me fucking handle what I need to. So that's how it works. And that's like all day long. Like that's like every visit long. Like it's no it's no uh yeah, it's that's just how it yeah. is. So that's what's gonna happen. So if you're down for that, I think we can make it work. I'm down. You have one minute remaining. Well you definitely don't have to tell me twice. I've been on board ever since I saw your picture. <laughs> I believe it. <laughs> I'm honest. Okay, so it says I only have one minute left, but yeah, you I honestly didn't think it was you. Oh, really? I know. You, like, tried me on that, like, in that one message. You're like, how do I know this is really you? <laughs> 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 I'm like, it is. It is me. <laughs> hey, but listen. So how um, long, how long do you want to do a side watch? Well, I don't know like man there's this girl talking about till i go to prison but that sounds like ludicrous you know what i'm saying we're gonna try to figure it out tomorrow but here's what i'll do tomorrow i'm gonna call you okay i'll be able to get the phone 
right. and I'll call you. I don't know what time. Right. I don't know when. I'm just going to try to call you. All right? If you can right. answer, you can well, answer. It's going to disconnect, so I'll put more money on it. But For yeah. sure, do that. And look for me tomorrow. Okay. All right? I will. All right. Okay. Dolores, thank, thank you for the uh-huh. membership. Uh-huh. Thank you for using GTL. USA. Uh, I don't want to hear no USA shit. I want to hear some like I want to hear a Japanese girl pull up. You know what I'm saying? I want to hear some Japanese shit. I want to hear some fucking. What else we got? I want to hear a Japanese girl pull up and a Mexican chick. That's all I want to see. Let's see what happens. We got two more tries. Those are my wishes. What's up, short stuff? Hello. What's up, short stuff? Short stuff. Hey. Ew. Hey. Why didn't you come to fucking trial? I, t- I, I wrote you and told you why. Oh, well, thanks. I'll tell you what. You wrote me and told me why. Good. Perfect. Now I'm going to tell you what's going on. So what I need your help with. Ready? Gonna... No, happened? it's the only time I got it. You probably want to listen to this. What? Ready? Yeah. Okay. So after trial, they brought me back. They put me in the naked place, right? Yeah. That's basically the sum of the story that you need to know. So there you go. Yeah. In a nutshell, why, that's why the sum. That? Well, just keep in mind what that means. No phone. No emails. No canteen food um no visitation and why would they do that what i'm saying is it violates my rights because guess what when you're here you only get the phone on one time a week you get one shower a week i don't get my canteen i don't get the phone i don't get to email you i can't talk to my lawyers i can't do anything and i'm not even suicidal so if they're going to keep me here for that long that's called let me tell you what it's called cruel and unusual time. let me t- that's called let me tell you what that's called you know when people do that when they when they instead of just telling you what it is and they that's called let me tell you what that's called that means they're bullshitting they're trying to figure out words to make it sound more than it actually is you know what that's called that's called no just tell me what it's called sir i'll tell you what it's called right now it's so crazy i'll tell you what it's called in a minute okay see that's called Tell me what it's called, you fucking idiot. Cruel and unusual behavior. Bro, get the fuck out of my face because with that shit. When you're here, you only get the phone on one time a week. You get one shower a week. I don't get my canteen. I don't get the phone. I don't get to email you. I can't talk to my lawyers. I can't do anything. Oh and I'm not even suicidal. So if they're going to keep me here for that long, that's called, let me tell you what it's called, cruel and unusual punishment. That's exactly what it really is. So we're going to have to, and I'm just mentioning how far you're going to go, Alexis, and what you're going to do. Because if you're just going to call Lee and he tells you, oh, there's nothing I can do, and then you stop there, and then you and you stop there, and that's all you're going to do, you're not going to hear from me for a long time. So if you're going to actually, like, do some real shit, that's what you're going to have to do. I'm going to do what I can do. Again, begging women. Begging women to save his ass. Ain't that a bitch? Ain't that some shit? Ain't that a bitch right there? <laughs> Just begging his ass off. Please help me. Mommy, please. Mama. Please help me. Fucking. No, no, no. Don't ever limit yourself. Not even in my situation. Don't ever limit yourself and say, all I can do, you can do a lot. Trust me. Okay, well, I mean, if I have to start calling you. Please. See, for, for, for self respecting women, this is a turn off. But for people who don't have any self respect, for people who just want attention for j- just just to have it because you've never had it before it feels so good for someone to want you this is what they go for have some fucking self-respect you can tell them what's going on i will it's wrong Blue crews lawyers the jail director of nursing I even the, even the sheriff's office the sheriff's office obviously because they run the jail so all of that well okay i'll do that there's a lot of stuff might have to happen. And you can even try to call Kevin Shirley, the second lawyer. You know, he's way better than Lee. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know. I got a meeting to his, get your speech. Do you have his number? Kev, no, he said he's going to need, arrange for me to get Kevin or whatever. I don't know. This is what Lee told me because I told him I wanted your speech. Yeah, basically, Christy, I'm a loser, baby. And some women are just like, oh, I'm so turned on. Oh, my God. He's so cute. I'm a fucking loser who can't take care of myself. Oh, my God. I can fix him. Oh my goodness, Jesus! You need a, you need to have a brain scan because there, there, there's shit like this in the real world. There's guys like this, just like him. They just haven't killed nobody yet. You know, beat their girl up, don't have a job, use their car, and they're just like, oh yeah, but but he, you don't know his heart though. 
Okay. All right. I just don't know his heart. That's fine. That's cool. Immediately. You wanted your what? Your suit and stuff, because Kevin has them all. <laughs> okay. All right. Here's Kevin's number. You ready? Yeah. Okay. All right. That's got- Kevin's number. And he's oh, so, he has yeah. such a boner for Kevin. Do you notice he always talks about Kevin to every single woman? Jesus, Kevin is not your savior. You know, Kendrick Lamar said, I am not your savior. Kevin is not your savior, bro. Kevin can't do shit for you. You get out of here. Dude, I'm like, dude, babe, I'm sitting across the way from my fucking cell, right? I'm just in a different goddamn cell, naked, right? But I'm looking over there in my room. I can see my goddamn stuff. What the fuck if I'm impulsive? What the goddamn difference is it between being here or right there? The fuck mm-hmm. is the difference? I'm not suicidal. Well, you know? I'm going to call. I'm leaving the doctor's office in like right. 20 minutes. I will call. Do everything I, you can, please. I will, I promise. Okay. I don't want to see you like that again. So why did you not call me? Because when I woke up, I went to go get in the car with everything, you're searching everything, and the battery, remember I told you I had to replace the alternator? Yeah. Well, I didn't get a new battery. I used the battery that I had. They just recharged it, and it had worked. Well, apparently not. The battery was drained completely, and they had nobody to jump me. And then, by the time that Tiffany got home to jump me, right, I walked all the way down to AutoZone and back with the battery. Still couldn't do it because somebody had to jump to get the car, like, on. The battery wasn't freaking charged. Then I walked in the house and all of a sudden she comes back. Wait, I already fell asleep. I even don't give a fuck. Like, I already tuned out. I don't give a fuck. See, that's that's your problem. You're talking about your problems to people who don't give a fuck. I don't give a flying fuck about your car problems. And Wade doesn't give a double flying fuck about your car problems. So, So now where are we? We're in a situation where nobody cares about you. And you're over here still giving energy over to them. It's the craziest thing. Go fix your fucking car. Go fix your car. Grind it out. Thug that shit out. Go through the rain. Walk down. And then you know at the end of the day you're going to be like, damn, but I fixed it though. You're over here talking to a fucking prisoner about, I don't give a fuck. You think he gives a fuck? No. That's the real world for you. It's got water everywhere in the freezer. You know the line for the freezer where the water comes yeah. out? It yeah. got too hot next to the yeah. copper pipes and bursted. No. Yeah, all over. The whole garage was soaked. The whole side of the house inside. The Dude, what kind of fucking... I don't care. What kind of fucking shit are you guys running over? <laughs> all right, well, listen. I love you. I'm going to go see if you can handle that, all right? <laughs> see if you can handle that, all right? I love it. Try that. Well, I'm going to call Kevin to now. And I'm going to call Lee. And then I'm going to call down to jail. Okay. All right, baby. Okay. I love you. Wait, you you're going to get that stuff from Kevin? Well, I'm like, yeah. I'm going to call him and bring this up first and then ask him when I can need to get the stuff. You better talk about this shit first. You better talk about this shit first. Listen, let me tell you something, though. I think he already gave my stuff to Wendy because nobody was there, and she took it with her, so I can okay. get it. Okay, well, I have Wendy's number, so I can just text Wendy and tell her I want it, or you can message her and tell Listen. her to give it to me, and I'll tell her Alexis. to meet me. Alexis, baby. Baby. What? Hello? Hey, right. just handle this situation. She's got my stuff safely. I will have her mail it to you, okay? Because you weren't there. You will get it, okay? Please okay. just call them and you better this issue. Get it. I'm going to do this, I promise. I don't fucking say something if I don't mean it. I'm going to. I'm going to make sure you get it. Okay. She took it with yeah. her because you weren't there to fucking pick it up. Otherwise, well, I'm going to call her too. Listen Can to I what call I'm saying. I love you too, Miss Lacey. No, just. <laughs> she. You know, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Just call the two lawyers, okay? Please. I will. And then I'll call and, and do everything else that you said, too, because there was a couple other things you mentioned if it needs to come to that. Oh, okay. I got you. Now, I'll try to call you today's Wednesday. I'll try to call you again on a Friday if I'm still in here. All right? Okay. All right. I love you. Stop okay. eating all those. Stop eating those bagels. I, <laughs> yeah, you'll get fat. Don't get fat. I don't like fat bitches, remember? Don't get too fat now. You're eating too much carbs. You're eating those bagels. You're doing too much. <laughs> oh, my God. Wait. One, He's telling Ari to go work out. He's telling this one not to eat too much of them bagels. You, damn, bro. You, chill. Damn. <laughs> All right, I love you. I'll talk to you later. Stop eating those bagels, though. You're getting fat, for real, though. I love you. But you're getting fat. I love you, though.